want to get your beat on, on going back and meeting Muhammad Ali. Forget the Evander Holyfield and, and all the conflicts and so forth. When you actually sat and met with Muhammad Ali, tell us what that meant to you. Hey, you know, I, um, listen, um, I met Muhammad Ali, I guess I was 11 years old probably. He came to the Spofford School for Boys, the uh, uh, detention school in the Bronx, in Spofford, um, Spofford Avenue. And um, that gave me the first... Um, and, uh, wow, they gave me the first inclination I wanted to be a fighter. And then meeting him again in recent years? Well, I always, tell him, that he, I always tell him that he came to the, the juvenile detention center, but he said, yeah, really. Like, he doesn't even remember. Even when he, he wasn't um, right. suffering from Parkinson's severely, he never remembered it because he's always been a goodwill ambassador to so many causes. He didn't remember that. Have you taken on new heroes, Mike, in recent years? I know Muhammad Ali is one of them. I know Customato was your father figure, your trainer for years. Have you taken on new heroes in this new evolution of, of Mike Tyson? Forget hey, the Iron Mike, but the new Mike Tyson? It's not necessarily a hero that I'm looking for. I'm just looking for the right thing to do. And that's what it's all about, doing the right thing. And sometimes the right thing is not always complimentary to yourself. Yeah. Well, Mike, I got to ask you before I let you go. How are all the pigeons? They're doing wonderful. A bunch of pigeons in your house. People don't realize that you're a big pigeon fan. How are they? Well, they're doing wonderful. It's just this is just a culture that we do in Brooklyn, and it's really an um, underground, worldwide culture is what people do. This is just what I was raised up since I was 10 years old. And when I'm dead or when I'm in a wheelchair, I'm gonna wind up wheeling my pigeons off to somebody, and this is just what it's gonna be. I'm gonna have them until I die. Mike Tyson, the documentary airs first on Fox Broadcast, and then it moves to Fox Sports 1. It's a six-part series, and the man you are looking at right now is the star of it. He is also, he is, he is no longer Iron Mike, just Mike Tyson. Mike, good to see you. Thanks for joining us. Thank you very much. Can you imagine they called me the baddest man on the planet? When I was a young kid, I wish somebody would say he was the baddest man on the, on the planet. If I couldn't beat him, I would get somebody else to fight him. Somebody walking around saying he's the baddest man on the planet. Kiss my, you know what. Yeah, and thanks for keeping it clean, Mike. We, we okay. had you on a 30-second delay, by the way, just in case you did. But we, Mike Tyson, thanks for joining us. Good to see you, sir. <laughs>